the absence of pull exercises in Sarah Thomas training regimen significantly contributes to the underdevelopment of crucial muscle groups, particularly the latissimus dorsi and trapezius. This imbalance not only results in an aesthetically unpleasing physique, but also predisposes the individual to poor posture and a range of health complications. While sit-ups remain a common element in many fitness routines, they can pose serious risks due to the repetitive flexion of the spine. This continuous movement may accelerate degenerative changes in the spinal structure, leading to chronic back pain and discomfort. Moreover, the excessive emphasis on sit-ups can lead to the tightening of hip flexors, which further exacerbates muscular imbalances and discomfort. Such issues ultimately hinder the effectiveness of abdominal training during workouts. Crunches can effectively engage the abdominal muscles, however, it is vital to avoid performing them excessively. Overdoing this exercise can result in repetitive strain on the spine, underscoring the importance of moderation for both safety and optimal effectiveness. Engaging in daily runs of 10 kilometers can jeopardize an athlete's well-being, particularly if they lack the requisite technique and physical conditioning. A gradual increase in distance is recommended to allow the body, particularly the tendons and ligaments, to adapt to increased demand safely. Incorporating body rows into one's exercise routine serves as an excellent method to enhance back muscle activation while offering a viable alternative to traditional sit-ups. This particular exercise not only promotes muscular stability but also contributes to overall strength development. For beginners, it is advisable to restrict full-body workouts to three sessions per week, as excessive training can impede progress. Adequate recovery time is crucial for the effective development of both strength and muscle mass. Intermediate and advanced athletes, on the other hand, may benefit from splitting their workouts into distinct muscle groups, allowing for more frequent training sessions. However, it remains essential to incorporate rest days to facilitate adequate recovery between workouts. Furthermore, mental recovery is equally important as physical recovery. Mental fatigue can adversely affect concentration and overall performance during workouts, thereby diminishing the efficacy of the training regimen. It is noteworthy that beginners frequently struggle with push-ups more than with squats, which highlights the necessity for exercise routines that are tailored to specific fitness levels. This customization ensures that exercises remain appropriate and achievable for the individual. Implementing the principle of progressive overload is vital for continued growth. Performing the same number of repetitions without variation can stymie progress, thus adjusting the intensity or type of exercise is essential for encouraging the body to adapt and become stronger. Lastly, incorporating variety into workout routines, whether it involves modifying angles or experimenting with different exercise variations, such as incline push-ups, serves to augment fitness levels while simultaneously mitigating the risk of injury.